Hi, I'm Katrina. And I'm Belinda. Welcome to Crumbs 13, the prayer edition. Um, we're going to just be praying and please join us and agree with us in prayer and we hope you share this. Yeah, let's, let's do it. All right. Heavenly Father, I just praise you and I thank you. I thank you, Lord, that you reside within our hearts. Lord, if there's anyone who's listening with listening ears who hasn't asked you into their heart, Lord, I pray right now in Jesus' name that they would ask you to come into their hearts and make it their home, your home within them, Lord. Lord, I am asking for a spiritual encounter for all who hear, Lord. I am praying that they hear with unplugged ears and see with unscaled eyes, Lord, that they would experience an encounter with you, that they would seek out a full baptism of you, Lord, both in spirit, water, and in birth, Lord. Lord, I just praise you and I thank you, Lord, that you're doing a new thing in each one who listens, in each one who pursues, in each one who hears, Lord. Father, I thank you that um, in your blood we are overcomers. We are overcomers of circumstances. We are overcomers of the wilderness. But Lord, I thank you for the wilderness. I thank you for the trials and the struggles and the circumstances that refine us into seeing your glory and your kingdom and your purposes beyond it. Father, I pray you meet each person in the wilderness. I pray that you reveal to them that it is a season and that you are returning for them and that you will meet them in it and that you will bring them through it. Lord, I stand in agreement with every word spoken by Belinda, by the blood of Jesus Christ. And Father, I just come against the spirit of distraction. Lord, would you expose everything in our lives that is a distraction? Any questioning, um, any responsibilities, um, even if they are things that are good, if they take away from our relationship with you, Lord, would you just expose that, Father? And Lord, um, we just thank you for the times when we do experience loneliness or hunger, um, whether that be a spiritual hunger or a physical hunger. Father, we just thank you for those moments when we are in the wilderness. Lord, we thank you that you, that is the place where you are meeting us. Yes, the enemy comes to steal, kill, and destroy, but those are those holy moments where you come and you give us life and you give us life abundant. And so I just speak that over every person listening right now. The life of Christ, Lord, may it just shower over them, Lord. And may it be so abundant that they just um, that they just cling to every word in Scripture. That they that they just cling to Your presence, Lord. That instead of clinging to what this world could offer them, that they um, that they just begin to cling to Your Spirit, Father. Lord, I just praise you and thank you that your presence is in us and all around us, that you go before us, behind us, and you're beside us, Lord. Father, may we just be aware of your presence in this day, and may we glorify you in everything we do and say. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Oh, his omnipresence is so real and mm -hmm. so true. Mm -hmm. I just pray that you experience it. Yeah. Thank you for joining us for this prayer time, and we hope it blessed you, and we can't wait to meet you at the master's table. God bless your day.